Happy birthday as well. You always find the latest courtyard. Even in solution. In out of the box. Hello and welcome to Radio Waves by Totterbert. If you enjoy reviews, comparisons, band scans of new and classic portable radios, then make sure to subscribe and tap the bell icon so you don't miss any of my most excellent videos. In front of us is a Texan PL330 and C Crane's twin coil ferrite antenna system. I'm going to use this to perform an evening medium wave band scan. First we'll look at the PL330, second we'll look at the antenna system, and three I'll start cruising the evening band. So let's check it out, the Texan PL330. A great little compact single side band radio. You can find these for $79.99 on Amazon. Definitely recommend picking one up. I'll have links below, support the channel, pick one up and have a lot of fun because it is a great little radio. I've enjoyed every bit of it so far. So features, left hand side, we have an FM and shortwave antenna jack, and this can be set to medium wave, which we're gonna do with the firmware. Headphone jack for FM stereo listening, nice. DC input, micro, charge the internal battery. Here we have 850 memories, nice ETM plus function, which is fantastic. It has uh, time stored categories. So if you do an ETM search, it'll remember what hour of the day you did the search and store the presets in that hour. So when you go back and you're cruising your presets, it'll check the clock to see what time it is and give you the presets uh, at that time. So that's amazing, loving that. Synchronous detection, single sideband. We'll try sync tonight if it's possible uh, with the antenna system. Speaker sounds great. A time set, alarm set, display function. Display function is nice. It can show local time, signal strength ratios up on the top corner there. We have a full 24 hour clock with seconds displayed. Power sleep function. A step, fast, slow, I believe stop. ETM to do search and store. And of course, numeric keypad uh, with functions like setting the medium wave 9 kilohertz, 10 kilohertz, and auto uh, sorting your presets, which is nice. Okay, 850 of them. <laughs> Uh, browsing, browsing frequency and browsing memory button, AM bandwidth button. You only get three, uh, I believe nine and a half, three and a half, and two and a half on the medium wave. Single sideband and synchronous detection button, upper sideband, sorry, lower sideband, upper sideband. And of course, you got your band keys, medium wave, long wave, FM, and then of course, short wave. And you can do ATS functions on those. Over here, we have the tuning knob, and of course, setting the hours, volume, setting the minutes, and setting the bandwidth control. Top of the radio, we have the FM and shortwave antenna. And going to the back, you can see there's no kickout stand, but it hasn't bothered me too much. Over here, you can see it's got uh, the frequency information, full coverages on everything, FM, medium wave, long wave, short wave, uh, got like it, plus of course it's single sideband, so you can listen to the ham radio operators. BL5C battery behind there. Uh, it does very well uh, compared to like to the RadioWow and Sihodon R108s. Uh, this Texan runs that battery really nice. Very good battery management system. All right, so next, the C Crane. This is our 200 millimeter ferrite element, uh, housed in its own protective housing there. We have this uh, PS2 type cord uh, that goes from this to the control box. And that can be a length of up to 75 feet, I believe, with no single signal loss, or might be 50. It's one of those two, is there 50 or 75 feet? That gets you outdoors with this. Uh, they even show it uh, under an eave to protect it from water. And then, of course, they give you waterproofing tips to silicone the uh, connection points. Uh, it's nice if you have a location where it's high RFI and you want to get outside the building. And once you're outside, you're not really turning this. You're just putting it in a position to where you get most of your stations. And, of course, the control box runs on a 9-volt battery for portable power. Or you can run a uh, adapter that comes with it, a 9-volt adapter. There's where the antenna comes in and this is where we get our output now that comes with a little feeder bar so if you have like a radio that does not have a jack like this one does you would just connect to a feeder bar and you put that feeder bar next to the antenna on the radio but since we have this direct connection we're going to go ahead and use it uh, this is just a simple patch cable that you had to buy separate uh, it is a uh, 3.5 millimeter uh, ts tip sleeve just simple mono jack pick this up for any audio store i got this from a using a th synthesizer, you know, like plugged in. So it's worked out pretty good. So we have that cable, which we're going to use in a moment. And of course, we turn this on, a little red light comes on. You have course tuning on the bottom knob. You can see the frequency is pretty good until you get to around 1400 to 1600. It gets, or 1700, right in this area here, it gets a little uh, looser uh, as far as uh, being on right on the money. So yeah, you like you tune it. That's how you'll tune your coil. And you use this to fine tune the center one. 
So great. All right, so let's go ahead and just show you a quick size comparison. Iron Man, he's the man with the master plan. He can spin like no one can. He loves Texan radios and sea crane antenna systems. All over land, man. That didn't make any sense. <laughs> anyway, deck of cards gives you an idea of just how big these items are. The control box and antenna systems are much bigger than the Texan PL330. So it makes it fun. All right, so let's get busy. Um, we'll turn the radio on. And right now, it's not hooked up to anything. As you can see, turn the volume up. First station, nothing. Now we are near dusk. So let's see, we can change our display. It's show time. So right now, yeah, it's 9.48 p.m. Central Daylight Time, and I'm near Chicago, Illinois. Let's find the station. So there you go. This is WAUK, Jackson, Wisconsin. Uh, there's your signal strength, the signal noise ratio. You're going to watch these numbers get stronger when I start using the twin coil system. I wanted to let you see what it looks like without it. There you go. So if you just plug this in right now, it won't do anything. So let's just show you. I'm going to plug in the system, turn it on, and it is going to do nothing. I'll even aim this antenna over here. So it's still using the internal antenna. So to use the C crane antenna, we have to press and hold three while the radio is on, while we're on medium wave, press and hold the number three key until it says CH-5. There we go. Now we're using the medium wave on the external jack. And then we can tune this. To see if we can get a stronger signal. Which I did see. My, my union brothers and sisters who are voting for Trump and voting for all these Republicans to go, hey, look, your contract cool. so, is on the So, yeah, we're about a half hour away from uh, dusk, so the sun just settled. So we'll be picking up all kinds of stations. I'm going to move this off to my left. Gets away from the camera, which is nice. And I'll be spinning that versus spinning the radio, which is really cool. Bring this down here. We'll bring it in the frame. So you can see me tuning away. Let's look at this. This looks good. Okay. Perfect. Okay, let's keep going. Let's go back down one. Just curious if I can pick up 530. Might be too early. Just picking something up so I can go bandwidth. Oh yeah, I got to use the bottom control. I got the older version firmware. So we're picking up something at 530, just barely. Oops, that's already in it. Let's go back up. Okay. This wave made a lot of changes. 40. There's 550. KTRS, St. Louis, Missouri. So we're picking up a little interference from 560, so let's do the sync with lower sideband. What's upper sideband? That sounds good. Oh, yeah, the station came in nicer. Cool. Okay, we'll keep going. And I think you need to be a little bit more strategic if you're going to uh, somehow make Saudi Arabia pariah state. You can't expect to come back and get favored. Local station, as you can tell, the numbers got really high. 560 WIND Chicago. 
all now correcting the record. Uh, they started correcting the record pretty fast once. Yeah, when you change the next frequency, they're so close, you just use this one first before you start changing the, the f course tuning. Go fine tuning first. 570, we're picking up a WNAX, Yankton, South Dakota, 460 miles, 5,000 watts. We were kind of faded on us. Okay, here's WTCM. Traverse City, Michigan, 215 miles, 1,000 watts. That's awesome. I'm watching those numbers. It's like, <clears throat> it's going to be a guide when I'm tuning this. So here's 590 WKZO, Kalamazoo, Michigan, 137 miles, 5,000 watts at night. Um, different industries. All right, that's another question that I didn't bring up. I mean, long term, what do you, you want, want to, for a living? Do you want to pivot to the industry of, of, of company B? Here's 600 WMT Cedar Rapids, Iowa, 175 miles, 5,000 watts to the west. This is cool. <laughs> it's so neat not having to turn the radio and I just got the element over here because you can see nothing. Try to get away from the phone. There we go. Okay, so Black Information Network on 610, that's something new to me. Um, maybe it's a uh, station was bought out or something. Um, I'll try to look it up and find out. If I can, I'll put it here. We're not very far into the radio, and I'm already pushing 13 minutes. So let's go ahead and go a little quicker. Here's Milwaukee, WTMJ. Tune it up. Today on the show, uh, the Ken Coleman show, 30% of people who change jobs in the last two years are regretting it. Whoa. 30%. They took the paycheck and then they said it wasn't as good as we thought it was going to be. Or they're 620. Ah, they're playing Pink Floyd. Nice. <clears throat> WTMJ, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Let's keep going. Just for a pay bump. It's got to be a long term. <laughs> okay, this music here is. Um, Religious KYFI, St. Louis, Missouri, 275 miles, 5,000 watts. Sometimes I get country, CFCO. I don't hear it. Okay, 640s, probably local, WMFN, Piatone, Illinois. Also, new information for people experiencing a mental health crisis. Oh, cool, I just turned it. Hmm. Starting this Saturday, each stage will be rolling out. 
This is WOI Ames, Iowa, 265 miles, 1,000 watts. This antenna is nice. Okay, it wasn't a second station. Thought it was. <laughs> okay, keep going. Yeah, since it just went dark, uh, WSM isn't coming in really good, but we can come back to it and see if it, it got better. We're picking up 670, so hit sync. And sometimes you can pick up WFAN out of New York. It's a lower sideband. Beautiful, it works. <laughs> uh, WFAN. Um, it, the sync didn't work. We're just using the lower sideband. Okay. Go sync. There it is. Excellent. So WFAN um, is New York, New York, 750 miles to the north east there. Nice. And you can hear the frequency uh, getting bombarded with 670, which is the next frequency. Then that would be Rory McElroy playing out at the the British Open. Strong station to WSCR, Chicago, home of the Cubs. He wasn't good enough to win. Entered the final round in third place, or excuse me, he entered Sunday the final round with a four-stroke lead and. So this is 680. Upper side. It's cool, it's coming in CFTR, Toronto, Ontario, 460 miles. Seven hundred WLW Cincinnati, Ohio, three hundred miles. Then they're fully vaccinated and double boosted. Okay, that's the sink, lower sideband. Getting away from seven twenty. WOR, New York, New York. Nice. We distributed among the 79 South and West Side finalists announced today. A jump of new COVID variants as Chicago and Cook County. Here's 720 WGN. Chicago. In public spaces. Omicron I think I mentioned I'm near Chicago, Illinois. Five are highly contagious and could be especially hard on people who aren't vaccinated. Another station we could try for. 
is uh, the Fiend Manitoba. Let's go sink. See if it comes in. Oops, I didn't hold it long enough. There we go. Upper. Okay, don't hear anything. Let's keep going. This is Zoomer Radio, uh, CFZM, and uh, I'm just going to turn it down because I don't want a copyright thing. And I'm going to look to see if I can tune this while it's turned down to see if I can't boost this just by looking at the numbers. Usually the audio is nice to hear too. We'll fine tune it. There we go. So there it is, CFZM, Toronto, Ontario, 460 miles. Usually comes booming in, but since we're so close to sunset, sometimes it doesn't. Um, but yeah, we can definitely improve it with this twin coil. It's amazing. As you heard, WSB 750, Atlanta, Georgia, 630 miles. Yeah, we're not going to get through the radio band. It's just, it's just showing what it can do. WGR Detroit, Michigan, 270 miles. Go a little quicker. Here's WABC. Let's try to sync one more time. This is a good spot to check it. Okay, not picking anything up. All right, let's turn that off. Keep going. A series of these incidents happened on a pretty broad scale in multiple neighborhoods. Of 780 WBBM, Chicago. Um, the need for this Old time radio, Monday through Fridays. So it's my 12 a.m. to 1 a.m. Love it. Give the police the tools they've asked for. In at least one incident, fireworks were shot or thrown at police officers. So CKLW Windsor, Ontario, 270 miles. Which is about 270 miles. The House Committee investigating the U.S. Capitol attack subpoenaed the Secret Service. For text messages, agents reportedly de deleted right around January 6, 2021, the date of the Trump riots. Committee Chairman Benny Thompson said in a statement, the committee understands the messages have been erased. Thompson outlined an aggressive timeline for the production of the document. This could be a local WCPT, Joliet, uh, Illinois, 60 miles away, 1,500 watts at night. Or it could be WBAP, Fort Worth, Texas, 810 miles. They're mixing in and out. Okay. WCCO, Minneapolis, Minnesota, 310 miles. WHAS, Louisville, Kentucky, 300 miles, co uh, ground zero and coast to coast in the evenings. Be a little early for Denver. Let's keep going. Here's 860, this is uh, CJBC, Toronto, Ontario.
Albert Pujols actually thought he was done. He only had 13 home runs. And then Kyle Schwarber came up. So here's WWL New Orleans, Louisiana, 865 miles south. Another opportunity in Pujols advance. Tonight. Hello, Matt Rindy. Ah, yes, indeed. We do still have uh, some showers and uh, heavier thunderstorms. Most of which right now are in southwest Connecticut, uh, just starting to get on their way through. We should see this let up as we move through the overnight hours. And we'll still be humid, and we'll have lingering clouds over the down to 73. And then tomorrow, the high WCBS New York, New York. We'll have a bit of a breeze uh, in the afternoon, the high up to 91. Percentages that are very similar to the breakdown so, of journalists' ages 30 to 49. This is 890 WLS Chicago. For journalists 50 and older who I pitch wine coming from the camera. Viewpoints. All right, I can cut to the chase here. If I move this way over here, you don't hear it. I did a lot of research for on freedom of the press. Pretty nice. I'm about four feet away. In journalism school all over the country, there is an ideology that's being pressed. You know about critical race theory. You know about. Nice. And it. Cycling back to your Starbucks coin, I think that's exactly it. It's a lot of front-loaded investments for malls and coffee shops. And 900 is uh, going to be CHML, Hamilton, Ontario, 430 miles. Right, so we're going to cruise up the dial here. WFAW. WWJ, Detroit. Baseball and plays the MLB is the recognizability of its stars. WMVP, Chicago. If Mike Trout walked next to you in the mall, unless you knew who Mike Trout was, you're not gonna you're not gonna say, "Oh my God, that's." You might say, "Oh, that's a big guy." Yeah, yeah. he's what two hundred fifty pounds, two hundred thirty pounds. You might say, "Oh, that's a." He's, Pretty built. What weigh in on that? Sure. Uh, yeah, he's definitely running. He and I talk a lot. KDKA, so Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, four hundred fifty miles. So he just get an assumption that he not react as they should. That's the it's the exception to the rule. WBZ, Boston, Massachusetts, 880 miles. Nearly 400 police officers, and it took them 77 minutes to take this guy out. Tough situation. But in Indiana, in Indiana yesterday, yes, was held together with duct tape. Now that doesn't breathe. WHO, a lot of Des Moines, Iowa, 280 miles. And I'm thinking to myself, do I really want to do this? Here we go again. Here we go again. So WTAM, Cleveland, Ohio, 345 miles. On two hours of open line. Every broadcast of Coast to Coast. And so when you walked up, I wanted Andrew to stop and accommodate our friend. KMOX, St. Louis, Missouri, 275 miles. As you can see, I'm not tuning this. It's still working. We have approximately 30 local right now. Guy with gun kills murderer in Indianapolis. So here's 1180 WHAM, Rochester, New York, 545 miles. So as you can see, it works pretty good. All the way up the band. So we're going to go all the way up. You're going to find quite a bit on the graveyard bands at this time of day. WCKY, Cincinnati, Ohio. 300 miles, 1530, and it's still coming in nice with me tuned way out here. Of course, we can boost it by getting it closer. Nice. KXCL, Waterloo, Iowa, 210 miles. It's coming in clear, beautiful. Moving furniture 
Wow, nice. A lot of stuff coming in. Sixteen ten CHHA Toronto Ontario. Let's go to seventeen hundred. Music on KCJJ Iowa City Iowa, one hundred seventy five miles, thousand watts. It's the according to canonical form. So if a Catholic ignores that Local. and doesn't get married WSJP. that way, then the, the presumption Wisconsin. is that that's an invalid. WQLR, Kalamazoo, Michigan. Okay, we're almost done. I want to check one more thing, though. 1680, WPRR, Grand Rapids, Michigan. Okay, ran out of time there on my memory. Okay, so we'll finish this up. 1690. 1700. We have KBGG, Des Moines, Iowa, 280 miles, and then we have KKLF mixing in there. Okay, so I wanted to check uh, Nashville. Okay, we got a uh, warning uh, on 650. <laughs> nice. Okay, turn that off. So there it is, the Texan PL330. Press and hold. Um, yeah, working with the C crane. I love it. Absolutely fantastic pair. If you enjoyed the video, give it a big like. It's the best. It ran a little long. Two, if you like Texan radios and C crane products, subscribe at the bell icon. And three, comment below what you think about this twin coil fair I hooked up to the little Texan PL330, turning it effectively into a super radio. Very cool. <laughs> All right. Thanks, guys, and we'll see you in the next one.